Hello, wonderful, beautiful people, how are you? Today I'm talking about the fact that nothing's true. Does that make it sad to live here when nothing is true? I'll tell you all about it on the other side. So I was asking the emissaries about that and I said, look, you keep saying nothing's true. Nothing is believable. Doesn't that make life not worth living? Doesn't that make it sad that nothing's true? And they said, no, it doesn't. Quite the reverse. What it does is allows you to put some distance between reality, wherever that is, and you. That you can say, look, this is all a bit shitty, isn't it? It's all a bit like, yeah. Yet, because I know that it's not real, it's not really real and there's no truth to this, then I can kind of relax a little bit and not take it so seriously. The issue is when something is true, the whole truth and nothing but the truth, when it's going a bit peak tongue, when it's all a bit upside down, when it's tits up, it's not very nice because then you, where do you go to? If this is the truth, if this is the reality and it's a pile of fucking shit, where do we go? And that's what the emissaries were saying was, when you know that this is just a game, when you know that this is just something that's going on, that's pretendy, it takes all the pressure off. You don't have to take it seriously anymore. And boy, that's important not to take this seriously. How could you? How could you take all of this seriously? And they give me an analogy of football players, okay? And they said, when football players go on the field, they at no point do they believe that this is going to be a game that will last for their entire life. At no point do they believe that this is not a game, but this is actual, this is reality, this is life as it should be. No, they know that they're playing a game. However, does that stop them from throwing themselves into it wholeheartedly, giving everything that they've got? No, it doesn't. In fact, that's what they do. They play as though their life depended on it. They play as though this was the only thing that was worthwhile playing for. However, however, imagine somebody plays and then they get sent off for doing a foul, okay? And they're sitting on the bench. When they're sitting on the bench, they know that this is a game, it's a bloody game, and it's not fair either. They're not saying, this is the end of my life. Life will not continue because I'm no longer in the game. No, no, they just think, well, I hate this game, I don't know why I ever went into football. I should have been a carpenter like my dad, like Jesus. No, so that's the idea of this life. We've got to throw ourselves into it as though that this was all that there, there was. Whilst at all times remembering that this isn't all that there is. And, and it's this paradigm, uh, this dichotomy that we find ourselves in of, hey, I've got to pretend that this is real, but I know it isn't, but I'm still going to pretend. You know, throw yourself into the heat of battle, but keep your feet at the lotus flower. That's not, they're not my words. I think they're Buddha's words, yeah. But that's what it's all about. It's like pretending that it's real and knowing at all times that it's not. That's when there's no pressure. That's when you don't get depressed. You don't get sad. I mean, yes, you'll still get sad every now and again, you know, when you think, oh my God. But you don't get as sad as you do when you believe that this is all that there is. That's why there's so much depression and anxiety in this world because people believe that that's all that there is and there's nothing else. This is all there is and it's shit. I mean, it would be a twatful life. And I use that word it, it, with, great, with great import. It would be a twatful life if this was all that there was, if this existence was all that there is. Disastrous, but it's not. And it's not even real. And so they're all the pressures off. So you can relax now and join in, always knowing that it's not real. I'm not real, you're not real. 
none of this is real, but let's pretend that it is. And have some fun. I love you all and I'll speak to you all later. Bye-bye.